khatira. When you hear the, the commentator saying khatira, 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 it's dangerous. Like it's a dangerous play, it's, it's risky. Hala, 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 kif halkum, shu akhbarkum. In today's video, we're gonna be going over 15 words that you absolutely need if you're gonna be following or watching World Cup games, football games in Arabic, okay? Um, even if you're not a football or soccer fan or following the World Cup, these will come in handy because it's just a good way for you to expand the set of words that you already know. Okay, so let's get into the video. Okay, so starting off with a word for the sport, soccer slash football, Kurat Al Qadam. Kurat Al Qadam or Kurat Qadam. We don't necessarily always need the Al, you can just say Kurat Qadam. Uh, kura is ball, Qadam is foot, ball of the foot, uh, Kurat Al Qadam. Kurat Al Qadam. And then we have the word for field or basically where the players play. We would say Malab, Malab, so football field slash soccer field. Malab, Malab, again, لعب is he played. So Malab, the place where playing happens, Malab. So Malab, Kurut Qadam, football field. Goal, in commentating, if you're watching a game, you will hear the word goal, Adi, it's normal, even though it's an English word, but goal, it's used a lot. And you hear it extended, goal for a lot longer than that when the commentator is commentating goal and they're usually very very excited and super enthusiastic and yeah going crazy if somebody scores if you want to know the word for goal literally it's hadaf hadaf and you do hear it sometimes hadaf and you could use it just like how we use it in english in normal everyday life my goal is to one two three hadafi wahdin talati my goal in life hadafi bil haya hadafi my goal hadaf a goal then we have the word for team before we get into that, if I want to say the word for stadium, you could say stad, you could say stad. So stad, malab, we can say malab kurat al qadam. And then um, for, yeah, for the football field where the players play, the pitch, malab, then stad, the, the arena basically, or stadium, arena or stadium. And then team, fariq or fariq, in, in ammi, again here we're using Palestinian or Jordanian um, pronunciation. So Fariq rather than Qa, we don't use the Qa a lot, Fariq, we'll say Fariq or Fariq, depending where you are. So Fariq, player, La'ib, La'ib, players, La'ibin, La'ibin, goalie, Haris, of course if you want to say the goalie, you would say Al Haris or Il Haris, Al and Il are the same, it's just a pronunciation thing, Al is used a little bit more in Fusha or MSA, and then Il more in Amiya. If you're new to Arabic, make sure to check out the free mini course. We talk about the different types of Arabic and all that. And uh, there's also a mini intro of the full course in, um, that, we, that we have. Next, we have the word for coach. Coach is Mudarrib. Mudarrib. We're really stressing that R or rolling it. So not Mudarrib. 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 Okay, of course, the coach, Al Mudarrib or Il Mudarrib. Referee, Hakam. Hakam. The referee, Al Hakam or Il Hakam. And then some positions. So attack is Hujum, Hujum. Defense, Difa. Hujum, Difa. And then midfield, Khat Wasat. Khat Wasat. What else do we have? So as far as um, plays that you have, like a pass, okay? Or a shot. So pass is Tamrira, Tamrira. Tamrira. And then uh, if you want to say shot or yeah, shot or aim, tasdida, shot, tasdida. And then uh, if you want to say kick, you would say rakla. So there's a lot of rak raklat, raklat jaza. You're going to hear this a lot, penalty, raklat jaza. Usually um, if, if you hear this, you know, everybody gets super dramatic, raklat jaza, oh, and you hear the commentator going crazy about it too. So raklat jaza. Penalty kick. Rakla uh, hurra, hurra, free kick. So the word hur is free. Hurriya, uh, freedom. Hur, free. So free kick. Rakla uh, hurra. Of course, there has to be alignment. If it's a feminine noun, so rakla, usually nouns ending in R, A are feminine. So the adjective has to match. Rakla hurra. So not hur, in this case, it would be hurra. Okay? And then Shu Kaman, what else do we have? Uh, Rukniya, corner kick. Rakla Rukniya, or just Rukniya sometimes, corner kick. And then these, yeah, these um, Lamset Yad, for example. Lamset Yad, handball. Lamsa is a touch. And then Yad, or Eid, is, is hand. In Ami, you say Eid, but Yad, hand. So Lamset Yad, touch of a hand. So handball, okay? Lamset Yad, Tasallul, Tasallul, offside, Tasallul. Offside, tasallul. 
And then khatira, when you hear the, the commentator saying khatira, 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 it's dangerous. Like it's a dangerous play, it's, it's risky or it's, uh, uh, it's yeah, somebody's about to score. Like khatira, they say like khatira, dangerous, yeah, somebody's about to score. Okay, khatira. Um, what else? What? Okay, I know what about the So stoppage time, basically the time that you lost. Um, during fouls or whatever reason the referee had to stop the game during the regular time they usually add extra additional time it's not called extra time it's called stoppage time bil arabi we call it what badal daya waqt badal daya or waqt badal daya literally the time instead of the time that's lost waqt badal instead waqt is time badal daya daya the last so waqt badal daya stoppage time if you want to say extra time so this is the time if, if there's a tie and it's not at the group stage and the, the both teams are playing extra time the extra 15 minutes what idafi or what idafi idafi extra okay or additional and then what else we have in natija shun natija shun natija or shun natija and natija in natija the the result what's the score or the result shun natija shun natija you can ask who's winning to mean faiz Who's winning like so far? Mean Faiz, Mean Faiz. Uh, past tense, Mean Faz. Who won? Mean Faz, who won? Tamam. Let me know if there's other words that you guys have heard, even if it's in English, in English commentating, that you'd like to know the translation of. Like something commentators say a lot. Let me know in the comments. Come on, let me know what team are you cheering for. Uh, of course, you know, World Cup vibes right now. So let me know if your country's in the World Cup. There's another video that we did listing the World Cup countries or the countries that are in or countries that are competing in the World Cup uh, over here. So make sure to check it out. And if your country is in there, make sure to comment in Arabic. Okay. Let me know if there are any questions. See you in the next video.